Hello everyone, it's Haley from Hey Hawk Beauty, and today I'm going to be showing you a simple witch Halloween makeup application. Now I know that a lot of the time Halloween does show up on a weekday and all of us do tend to have to work the day of Halloween so we don't really have a whole lot of time to make those crazy glamorous makeup applications. This one's going to be super simple, super easy, super quick. So here we go. Now for this makeup application we're going to be starting um, with our face already almost done. Um, so if you were at work earlier in the day and you already have foundation on and your eyebrows on and stuff like that The only thing you really need to take off is if you have a lip color on or an eyeshadow um, So you can see that I have a bare lips bare eyes and I do have foundation and blush on so this is our starting point This is what we want to start with So I'm wanting to keep this makeup look a little more traditional However, I don't want to do it completely traditional where my whole face is green so that's why I already have my makeup ready to go. So we're going to stem the green to our eyes and our mouth. First, I'm gonna start off with the crease color and we are going to use Onyx Shadow Sense. So now that we have our crease color with Onyx Shadow Sense, we are going to go in with a base for our lid. And like I said, I want to keep this more on the traditional side to where I want to use a lot of greens. So we are first going to start using Mystic Moss. It's a matte shade. Now we're gonna wait for that to dry just a little bit. And I'm actually gonna grab a different brush. That way I can really pack in the color. All right, so now we're gonna wait for that to dry just a little bit longer. I'm going to go ahead and go back in with the brush that I used for the Onyx and I'm just going to blend it a little bit. Now I'm going to go in with the Green Shadow Sense that is part of our Rainbow Collection and I'm just going to tap that on top of where I put the Mystic Moss. take the same green and we're going to put it on the lower lash line. Now I'm going to use the same brush but the opposite side and we're going to apply some palm glitter. This is just a glittery green. If you guys are noticing, I'm putting this only on my lid and not in my crease. And now since this is a shimmery eyeshadow, I am tapping it on to keep that glitter in there.
and I just used the opposite side to put on some glitter on my lower lash line. Now this is my makeup brush from my foundation. There's leftover product on it. I'm not putting any new product on it, but I'm just gonna clean up underneath my eyes. Now I'm just gonna go back in and use the same brush that I used to apply my crease color, and I'm just going to kind of blend this in just a little bit more since I applied more product. Now I'm gonna go ahead and apply some mascara. I don't think I'm gonna do an eyeliner with this. to apply fake lashes just because I feel like a Halloween makeup look isn't finished until you apply some fake lashes. So the lashes I'm going to be applying I literally just got from the dollar store for $2. Super cheap, um, but they work really well and they're really pretty. Now you just have to wait for them to become tacky and then you can apply them. Now it's going to be super quick and I'm going to do the other side. I don't understand why, but a lot of times one lash always applies so much better than the other one. And clearly that one was not cooperating. So I'm going to go ahead and put on some more mascara just to bind them together. Obviously, this makeup look isn't going to be finished without some lip, so let's get that. So you're always going to want to make sure that your lips are nice and clean. Um, I just have some lip balm on mine, so I'm just going to wipe it off real quick. Now that we have a nice clean lip, now we can apply some lip scents. And today for this look, I'm going to be applying Blackberry, but it's going to change color. I'll show you in a second.
thought a black lipstick looks this good. <laughs> Look at how white your teeth are. All right, so now we're gonna apply the gloss and this is where I said the color was gonna change and you guys are gonna love it. We're gonna put on some Clover gloss. Now this is a limited edition gloss and honestly, I'm not sure if you can get this anymore. You might be able to, but I'm not sure. All right, are you guys ready for some magic? You guys didn't know I was a magician, did ya? <laughs> Who would have thought my black lipstick is turning green? looks not done yet. Totally forgot that I wanted to put in shimmery in the inner corner of my eyes. Go figure, that's like my favorite part of my makeup. The inner corners. Oh, it's so pretty, oh my gosh. I should just wear this every day. We need to do some highlights. And we'll just go ahead and use this since we already got her out. Don't want to forget the cheekbones. Get her shiny, Cupid's bow, just a little bit though. And there you go, here's our finished witch Halloween makeup application.